Good morning. I'm Terry McGeary and today I'm in Glasgow having a look at some of the venues for culture. Uh, if you're into ballet, drama, comedy, music, uh, Glasgow is the place to be. So I'll be taking you around about one or two of the venues here and showing you what we have. Places like the Oran Moor behind me here, which is a pub which in 1974 uh, started off a marvellous concept, which is a play, a pie and a pint. And for the modest sum of about £12.50, you can watch a play, you can have a pint of beer or a glass of wine, and you can have a bog standard meat pie or a piece of vegetarian quiche. So I love the place, I've been a few times now, and I'm just about to go in and buy my ticket. There we go. Yeah. Uh, right, just one ticket please. Lovely. Thank you very much. Cheers. Right. And here we go. Into the pub part of it and the theatre is right through the back. It's a bit of a rabbit one really. It's popular today, look at that queue. My goodness. Well, I've just met my old friend Marion in the queue and she said I should remind people if I'm doing a YouTube on this to mention the queues. Down we go. I have a feeling this might not be friendly for wheelchairs, but I don't know for sure. And that is the founder of the whole concept, the late David McLennan. And Theta is here. Eventually. Hey, you can this place. Okay. Brilliant, thank you. Next please. Yes. And look at the pie. What a quiche. Okay, thank you very much. That's a nice one. Ah, cheers. And a reasonable seat. And I won't be able to show any of this because I can't record it. Unfortunately, we haven't spoken to the artists involved. So if you're in Glasgow, if you're coming through to Glasgow for on holiday, look up playpiepaint.com uh, or just Google it, find out what's on and come in. You won't regret it. Excellent. Okay, back out onto Byers Road.
That was great. Loved oh, it. Absolutely. Thank you. Oh, can I video you and say how much I loved it? Oh, of course you can. That's magic. Neshla. Neshla, yeah, yeah. Oh, shake your hands up. That, that was magic. Really <laughs> oh, good. Thank what you. I'm doing is I'm doing some wee YouTube things. That's a, right, okay. a retirement thing that I'm doing now. Great. Like things to do in Glasgow. Oh, places good. to go. And so that's going to be included. Oh, as is a citizen's conservatoire where you trained as well. That's right. Yeah, I noticed that. it in the thing. <laughs> so that's what I'm going now to a wee trip down there. Brilliant. That was good. Thanks very oh, much. Thank you for coming. That was thank magic. You. Thank See you. Later. Well, that was great meeting one of the actresses from the show that I've just seen. I'm now taking number six down into town. And we'll have a quick visit to the Royal Conservatoire of Scotland, which is just a few yards. We'll see what it's got to show. Here we are, just behind me now, the steps up to the Royal Conservatoire of Scotland. It trains, has trained and is still training some of the best actors, actresses and performers in the country. There we are. There we go, box office straight away. This is, this is us in the Conservatoire, canteen area. And it's a busy day today, they have a few items on today, they have a, a governor's uh, reception, they have auditions for junior members of the, the school, and they have a competition on, so maybe we'll try and have a look at the competition. I'll just go over here and buy a ticket, very cheap, it's only about £2. Well that was good, that's free with my royalty card, I'm just videoing myself. <laughs> I know I can't use it inside, so I won't. It's all right. Go enjoy. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Well, time flies when you're enjoying yourself, and I've just had two or three very enjoyable hours watching a competition for woodwind in the Royal Conservatoire. Before I leave, I think I'll just let you have a look at some of the alumni who have been trained here. And these are actors and actresses, some big names you will know. But of course it's not only the people who are in front of the camera or on the stage who are trained here. There are also lots of people behind the scenes who are in charge of making the whole thing work. And they also get excellent training here. The Conservatoire ranks third in the world. It used to be sixth and fairly recently it's gone up. I'll have a quick look people before we go. Some of these names are well known Scottish and UK wide actors worldwide. Yes, yeah, so we got down here we have Robert Carlyle as well. And a couple of my favourites also David Heyman. I'm a Scottish actor and it's Ron Steele. Well, that's about enough for us. I think it's time oh, that I left the World Conservatoire and headed home for the day. I think two bits of culture in one day is enough for a day. That would be good. Theatre skills, filming skills, all of these things are here. 